Hi everybody, welcome back to the channel and welcome to episode five, the final stage on the flaking display stand. I've gone in this morning and pre-drilled just some 10 mil holes for the locators, which are these ones. So all the fixing holes are drilled out in the places they need to be in, so that's done. The next stage on this will be to chop some timber up. We're gonna timber batten the back of the display stand so we can mount some colour changing LEDs to the back. And then we're moving on to clear coat stage. So I'll stick in some time lapses. You'll see all this come together and I'll give you a chat at the end. See you in a bit. finished Flake King display stand. I hope you've enjoyed these little episodes on this build. I'll give you a little talk through now on the bits as you've seen in them time lapses. So with these locators that mount this to the wall it gives you that nice 30 mil gap off the wall around the outside and that gives you that nice bit of clearance for the LEDs so when you put the lights on you've got that nice glow that goes around the outside that just finishes that off and you can just colour change them to what you want. So you can just set it for the mood for the studio or when you're filming and things like that. So the actual brackets that I used for this are stainless steel hook brackets and they just fit the guns absolutely perfect. So you've got the FK1000, mirror match both sides and they just hook on like that. And then the FK500, I've done a locating bracket and then mounted a twisted bar on and that just slides in the nozzle like that nice and comfortably and that holds that to the front there and pinches that off. The actual spare nozzles you get in the Pro Kit, I was looking at the size of these and they fit perfectly over the locating bolt. So you've got your spare nozzles that you can clip onto your mounts there, so they're all to hand. So it's basically built for the studio. So I've got the guns all to hand in the studio so I can just grab one. We've got the Iwata stand behind me that side and now we've got the Flake King one this side. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you can join me in the next one. The next video that's coming up is going to be a review. I've just had a parcel turn up from airbrushes.com so a big thank you to them for sending these bits out that I'm going to show you now for the next review. We've got the Art Tool Ultra Mask. So I've not tried this one guys, so this is new to me, so we're going to give this a whirl, give you a full review on this. And we've also got some fine line range by Flake King, we've got the full range of the Flake King tapes, so I can give you a full review on some fine line, we'll get a panel out and we'll do some pin lining and see how these tapes perform. So that's what's coming up next. Just want to say a big warm welcome to all the new subscribers that have come over in the last couple of days. And for all the comments guys, it's much appreciated, it really is. Um, it just makes it all worthwhile putting this content out. I'm glad you're enjoying it. So yeah, that's the finished stand. Hope you've enjoyed it and I'll catch you in the next one.